हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल आई विल बी टेलिंग यू दैट हाउ टू रिक्वेस्ट अ रिमोट इमेज यूजिंग जे क्यूरी एज एक्स मेथड सो इफ आई क्लिक ऑन डाउनलोड इमेज इट विल बी रिक्वेस्टिंग द इमेज फ्रॉम द अनस्प्लैश ए पी एंड इट विल बी डाउनलोडिंग ए रैंडम इमेज यू कैन जस्ट राइट क्लिक एंड सेव दिस इमेज ऑन टू योर लोकल सिस्टम लाइक राइट लाइक दिस एंड इफ आई क्लिक अगेन डाउनलोड इमेज इट विल बी अगेन बी जनरेटिंग ए रैंडम इमेज लाइक दिस इफ आई कीप ऑन प्रेसिंग दिस यू विल सी दैट रैंडम इमेजेस विल बी शोन टू बी from the unsplash api so in this way guys we will be building this application so let's get started so for building this application we will be starting from scratch just create a index.html file inside your visual studio code and we will be giving a title to it of uh, image download using jquery ajax so now inside the body we will be having a simple button which will be on click we will also give it as uh, download this is a function that we will create and the label of the button will be simply download image and now we just need to include jquery so i will copy paste the cdn which is required for jquery so you can just search for google jquery cdn and go to w3schools.com this is a great website for web development so copy paste the cdn like this copy this and you just need to paste the cdn like this after this make a script tag and inside the script tag we will be writing our function which will be download and inside this guys we will be using the ajax function of jquery so write here dollar dot ajax this takes some options first is the url so what url we will be making a request to we will be making this request to this url which is https colon colon source dot unsplash dot com slash random and then slash the dimensions of the image so 500 comma or oh, multiplied by 500 so the width and the height and the second option we will pass is the catch which will be false here and the third option we need to pass is H XHR fields. So basically this is a property here we will be having the property which will be response type. So this property will be need to set to a blob because this is an image. So just set this property that's it. And now there is a success callback and the error callback. So if the call is successful then this function will execute. So this will hold the data and similarly a error callback so if any kind of error take place there will be an error here like this so we can just print out the error also console log error so if the request is successful we just need to create an image tag also where we will be displaying our image so image i will be giving the id to it of image so close the image tag and now we just need to get the get this image value so we will be using first of all we will be having our url so url is equal to window dot url dot create object url and then we will pass the data that's it and now we just need to target the id that we have given url and then we will be selecting this and manipulating the source attribute of it like this to url that's it so this completes the application and now if i refresh the application where it was my application this is the application if i click download image so you will see that a image will be shown to me just wait if i go to console here nothing is shown to me so just click on download image uh, I think that we need to um, let me just get the image here like this image document dot get element by ID and image like this and then we can just manipulate the source to URL like this so now if I refresh it just make it as URLs just make this change also this is IMG 
because we have given this ID to this IMG. If I click download image, you will see that a image will be downloaded and shown to me. If I right click it, I can see, save this image onto my local system. So like this. So if I save this, this will be saved onto my local machine. If I again download image, a random image will be shown to me. You can see that. If I keep repeating this, more images will be shown to me. So in this manner guys, we have made an image downloading application in jQuery using the Ajax method. So thanks very much for watching this video.